So as you can see in the title, so the story time is, I don't know, yeah, it's a story time. Um, yeah, it's been like two, three weeks since I passed the story time. So I thought I would do something, yeah, another story time today. Um, if you're new here, welcome. If you already subscribed to my channel, thank you. Welcome back. What up? To the what squad, something squad. We have to get our familiar name. Anyway, yeah. So today's story time is about how I. What title am I going to put? I don't know whatever title I put is about that. So where where does a girl start from? Where does one start from? I don't know. So yeah. Um. This happened when I was in high school, when I was in, um, I was in form six. So, I was in a single school. I don't know if you know the school I'm from, Woodland, but if you don't know, sorry. But this is the story time that happened when I was still in high school, in a single school. I was there from form one up to form six. So, yeah, um, when we were in form six, we had Sosh. Um, so she's like prom, yeah, it's like prom, except we're in single schools and we're moving another, with another school for prom. I'll do that in quotes in case some people don't agree with me. <laughs> but I might be misusing the word. Anyway, yeah, so we go for Sosh. Let me first judge you guys that story off topic. Kalito, we, 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 um, yeah, we had Sosh. Oh, I'm gonna another story time. I'll do another story time. Yeah. Yeah, so we, we go for Swash that that time, which will be another story on its own. We go for Swash. Um yeah, we, we we had one at the boys' school, then the, also the boys' school came to our school. I think it was a week apart. We have fun with the high school kids. Eh, eh, make noise, girls with noises, we buy dresses, what? Eh, hype. On a hundred percent, like what's exactly the number in a single school? You only see boys in holidays. Excitement 101. Hmm. Go for search in first term. Every year, there are three terms. That was first term. I go for search the whole time. We're talking about tea to what and then get this and this, this and this. If you're going for search, <laughs> I'm sure you can relate. Feel free to comment down on your social stories. I don't know. If you went for social with me, if you're in my school, if you're in the boys' school. Hey! Yeah. So we go for social. The day arrives, we go for social. ABCD, ABCD. That is another story. <laughs> anyway, so we get holidays. Uh, yeah, the end of the well, um, we do first, we do, we do end of term exams. After that, we get holidays. But I remember in my school, we used to get holidays for like. When we get to the days, we'll be home for like two weeks. And after two weeks, you go to school to pick your report. And then there were, you know, there, were, there can always be rumors at school or something. Or like, hey, people have passed, or people really failed or something. So there were rumors. Like, hey, people who, people who failed are going to be made to repeat. We're like, repeat? They always scare us, but no one ever repeats. Like, it's just a... Uh, Rumor, rumor, and it never like happened. So, was scared, yes, but not like so scared. So that day we just go to school. Unless the rumors get like stronger, what? Not even know what rumors get stronger. <laughs> so yeah, let me look in the camera today. Yeah, so the rumors get like yeah stronger. So we are scared. We like oh my god, because you don't know how you've performed. So yeah. 
I think they had two dilemmas. I'm not really sure, but I remember I went to school with Mary Potter with my dad. Yet I was used to being big Mary Potter alone, but this time I went with him. I don't know if they told us prior. But yeah, I went with him. Right there. And like those people who are repeating, you're not receiving no reports from the office, from the staff room, you're, you're, you're receiving no reports from the administrator's office. Obviously. You know where I was going, where I had to head to. <laughs> I had to head to the administrator's office. But I don't really remember like clearly what happened. But I remember reaching there and like, since I went to the office, I knew like they had chopped me, I was supposed to repeat. Oh my god, I was so devastated, I was so sad. So I go there with my dad. We were given my report, we enter office, she gives us my report. Obviously I had very poor marks, very poor marks, very poor. So I see my marks, but like this person, I don't see my marks, I'm still calm, I'm like, eh. Why are they like, hey, what happened? Then she's like, must be so sh. These guys went, they had too much fun. They've not been concentrating the whole time. They have been on their own things. That must be the reason why she has performed badly. So like, madam, you have to repeat. I'm going to make like restoration. Like, madam, you have to, I'm like, no, I'm not, I can't repeat. I don't want to repeat. They're like, how do your friends perform? Most of, we're in a group of friends of like, I want to say like 15 friends. And only three of us were meant to repeat. Can you imagine? <laughs> we looked so serious. The three of us, oh my god. So, like, yeah, hey, did you uh, have your friends perform well? I'm like, yes, it's just me and my other two friends who have been told to repeat. Have I known this by then? I think so. So, yeah, they tell her, they tell me, you have to repeat, but I refuse, I refuse. They start trying to, like, convince me, They're like, no, you're younger, you don't look old. Guys. This is me trying to show you my face that doesn't look old. <laughs> Guess my age in the comments, you know. <laughs> so yeah, they're like, you're younger, you don't look old, you can do it. Just just one year behind, your friends will be there for you. I know you, like in high school, that is the most like important thing in your life, friends. I'm like, my friends are going to leave me, and they're like, no, your friends are always going to be there for you. They're never going to leave you, what? <laughs> I refused, I was like, there's no way, I'm repeating. They tried talking to me. Obviously, by this time, I'm like, I'm crying, I'm crying. I'm like, I can't allow, I can't repeat. No, what? I'm thinking, obviously, of my life. I'm like, everyone I know, all my friends, as if that is what life is about. <laughs> all my friends, everyone's going to look at me, everyone's going to laugh at me. And I'm so worried, I'm like, no, no, no. They try talking to me, talking to me, I refuse, I refuse. We leave the office by this time. Like, I'm crying. I'm so scared. I'm like, I can't repeat. I can't repeat. I'm so scared. He's like, anyway, I can't force you. I said, then if I did, if I force you, I'm going to refuse and maybe you'll be pissed and fail. You like to come to school when you're pissed. You don't read your books. You fail your exams. He's like, let's go home and think about it. So I go home and like, I talk to my other two friends who are being made to repeat, who are crying together on the phone. Oh my god, you guys are so sad. We just sit on the phone and cry, like, you know what I'm going to do? What school are you going like, to Now we had planned to like change schools and not go back because we didn't want to look fake. Yeah, we're like, we're not going to go back to that school. I've looked for other schools. We can't go back. What? So one of my friends actually left and go to another school. The other chick. She was supposed to leave, but then first she ended up going back to our school and being allowed to continue with the rest. Then that left me. I yeah, I tried looking for a school. What? So this is when I went to the school and killed the chickens. <laughs> now that story should be able to add up. Yeah. Yeah. So I end up Going to that school, I didn't like it. Um, making the decision to go there was not easy, okay? It was so hard, it was so hard. I remember, I even ended up going to school late. Um, I reached when those guys had already finished their beginning of term exams. Ah, it was so hard. I can't explain it. I used to cry. Yeah, then. 
I think I left that school after a month and I went back to my old school. I found all my old friends. They were so happy. We were reunited. But fitting in in class was so hard. During um, break, lunch, I would be with my old friends. When we're in dorm, I would be with my old friends. But when it's time for class, I would have to be with my new classmates. It was so hard making friends. It was so hard fitting in. Ugh, it was so hard. Then when at some point the other year ended and my friends had to leave. Oh my god, I went back to school in first term. It was so hard. It was like the hardest time of my life. I cried. I, I did not go back to school. When I had to go back to school, I was just crying. Oh my god, I can't stay here. Put me in another school. Put me in another school. <laughs> you know, into school. But I, I wasn't spoiled. I was just really hurting. It was so hard. And because you know, my other friend had gone to another school and the other girls had all left. I was not like alone. I was forced to make friends. Where they in my room on the first night and everyone like when you you just come back home from school, you just come back to school from home. People have been doing like holidays, they're telling stories, they should make holidays, and all the people I was with in holidays are obviously home. I guess six back. I'm at school, I'm alone, I'm sad, I just sat there. It's like over oh, someone had died in my life, I was so sad. That first night, people are hey, seeing their friends. It's been a long time. What? Catching up. I had no one to catch up with. Because I had used to make friends with people when I, <laughs> when I had just been there. So it was so hard. And then, you remember that, that the next day after we had reported to school, we had an assembly. Went for the assembly. And I was, like, in my own world. Like, I couldn't, I don't know. I had that feeling of as if it was like someone had died in my life. Or like I had broken up with like my ex of like 10 years. I was just in deep thought. The water assembly, they were talking to us. And my mind was like elsewhere. After something like obviously, I had two friends who I had made. They were standing with me like, hey Claire, what's wrong? Are you okay? I just kept crying again. Oh, I can't believe my friends are not here with me. I'm alone. I can't believe I came back to the school. <laughs> Again, it was so hard. It was so, so hard. But I think after that day, um, I believe I'm a person who easily adjusts. Like, because it was in a situation that I didn't like, I wasn't happy. But I had to get used to it, make the most of it, get comfortable because there's no way I was going. So, yeah. I think that sums up my repeating story really. Then even in class, we had an econ class and the teacher was ugh, so dramatic. She's like, oh, repeat us, repeat us. Sit in front. <laughs> but yeah, I ended up making good friends. I'm still friends with some of them up to now. Actually, those girls who I was crying for so close to, we are no longer tight. So life is weird. I didn't think it would come to this, but yeah, I have new friends, I have a new life, I'm not comfortable with many, like many people, obviously, I'm st I still uh, jazz with people in my form I am at, really, after some time, that there's no difference, like, you can't even tell, and when I joined uni, I joined uni early, so I, I ended up actually graduating with my amates, <laughs> it wasn't really that bad, everything happened well, um, my other friend who repeated, she also did well for herself. She has finished her course. She's really happy in her life. I'm happy that uh, I didn't start crying. But yeah, I think we're happy where we are now. These things happen and it's not easy, but look how far we've come. Yeah, I'm, happy. I'm proud of myself. I've done my MBA. Um, um, I started my MBA last year. I'm finishing my MBA this year. This year. No, I'm finishing my MBA next year. Right now, I'm doing research. I'm so proud of myself. I'm moving on advice for people who might have repeated or in the process of repeating or you still hate yourself. Don't worry. Things get better. Obviously, the first few days, weeks, months will be hard, but guaranteed after like a year, everything is fine. You have new friends. 
you have moved on with your life, if you're still friends with your old friends, well and good. But life is normal. It doesn't change much. I'm actually happy it happened. Um, I wasn't serious in high school. I used to play. I used to read my books. I don't know. Maybe it was a little snail. But even reading my books in uni, I actually performed well, got a degree. I'm doing my master's. Really, who am I? If you know me from high school days, you would know, like, guys, who am I? A girl who has made to repeat has now come this far. I'm now doing my YouTube. I'm working. I have a job. I'm happy. I have very supportive family, very supportive group of friends. There's nothing more really that I would ask God for. I'm happy. So if you're going through it, you need someone to talk to. My DMs are open. Yeah. I'm a living testimony, guys. Living testimony. That everything can get better. Yeah. I guess that's all I have to say. Thank you guys for watching this video. Thank you for tuning in today. Don't forget to like my video. Subscribe and share with this video with your family and your friends. And if there's any content you'd like me to make, please let me know in the comment section down below. Um, I love you all and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Falling beneath your knees and you can't breathe. Everything you see reminds you of what you're not.